morning guys I just got ready I did my hair today I did my hair yesterday too I don't know I've just been feeling like actually styling it for once today I have a really long day I'm going to this filming of the Nancy Grace show in the city after class today so I have to be there by five so my friend Lisa is going to drive us to the city after class and it's like filming Nancy Grace and she's like debating with someone. I don't know. I don't really watch the Nancy Grace show. So I'm really not sure what the whole thing is about. But my contracts professor like invited the whole class to go. So me and my friends signed up. And then she basically said. She's like okay if you signed up you have to go. You can't back out. So now I'm going. <laughs> so it starts at 5. And it doesn't end until 8.30. And then I'm just going to take the train home. And Jesse's going to pick me up from the train. So he's going to drive me to school today, which is good because I don't feel like driving. And I just have like a regular day of classes today. Well, actually, in both of my classes, we're doing something different. In con law today, there's a debate about affordable health care, the Affordable Health Care Act. And so two people are debating and me and like four other people are judging. And then in legal skills, I have to do a presentation with two other people on like, I don't know, some some case. So that will be interesting. We're leaving for a class a little bit early because I need to go to the library to print out my notes for this debate. Because even though I'm just a judge, we have to ask two questions and that's like a huge part of our grade. So I wanted to make sure like I had notes on the case and like I really understood it. Just figured I'd fill you in on what I'm doing today. So I'm gonna go get dressed. And we're not allowed to wear black or white or a pattern like for the filming. So I have to wear an outfit that I usually would never wear. So I'm going to get dressed and then we probably have to leave like right after that. So I'll show you my outfit before I go. I'm telling you it's ugly. Since we have to wear a bright colored shirt and it can't have a pattern. Like what? I don't own any colored clothing especially with no pattern. So I'm wearing this long sleeve blue shirt that's really ugly. With just like a Victoria's Secret sweatshirt over it just for the day so I'm not freezing my H&M coat my H&M jeans and then these black boots that I don't know where they're from and just pretty much a typical outfit and I'm wearing my glasses that you all like so much Jesse's wearing his outfit I would be wearing what you call a typical outfit yeah, he's... you have to wear blue or white I guess so I don't know we were, just, they said you we're not allowed to, no, we're not allowed to wear black or white or patterns. My chauffeur has dropped me off at my destination. We have arrived. He'll be back to pick me up from the train station later. Up. Oh, what train station? Did you decide that yet? or what? I don't know yet. Like? I'll let you know. I'll let you know later. Bye. Bye. City. This is my favorite song. We're getting drinks before we go to this But are we thing. really? We are. I am. I'm getting Can you be in my vlog again? My little we, friend Lisa. We, That's Liana. We, we just made it to the city. We're gonna get a drink and then we're gonna go watch this thing. I don't even know what we're going to watch. Nancy I just came along for the extra credit. <laughs>
either later or tomorrow but it was really fun and I'm sure I have like little clips and pictures put in here but it was really fun I'm just super tired Chauffeur. Here. Hopefully. Not oh my tomorrow. god. That was a long day. It was fun, but it was a long day. Like usually I'd be asleep for like two hours now. It's 11:30. I gotta text my friends that I made it to the car safely. Are they all home already? Yes. I got home and did the quickest skincare routine and everything that you've ever seen. Packed my bag for tomorrow. If I have school, I'm gonna be so freaking pissed because I was banking on a snow day or at least like a delay or a canceled class or something. So hopefully I have a canceled class or a snow day or I'm gonna freak out. But I'm gonna just end this here. I'll probably have another clip tomorrow just talking about everything that happened today. But right now it's like 12, 15 and I'm dying. You guys know I go to bed at like 9 o'clock. So I will catch up with you guys tomorrow and end this vlog. Hey guys, it's the next day. So I figured I would just kind of talk about yesterday. Because it was just kind of like random clips at the thing. And then send off this vlog. But what I went to was not a filming of the Nancy Gray show. Which was what I thought I was going to. It's a new TV show that's going to air March 29th. That's the day the episode that I'll be in goes up. I mean, I'm in the audience. I'm not like the star of the show. But that's one that I went to. It's a new show on A&E called Grace vs. Abrams. And it's Nancy Grace and Dan Abrams. And they basically just like debate and talk about like big cases and things that are like going on either in the news now or like cases that have happened in recent history and like controversial things so it was really interesting I don't particularly like love Nancy Grace um she's just kind of like she does things for shock value and not necessarily to like actually educate the listeners and watchers but she just wants to kind of like shock them and make them like take her side instead of actually like educating people and letting them choose their own side I really like Dan Abrams this was my first time ever like really watching him so I really liked him he seemed more of like an educator but Nancy Grace is more of just like a shock value like talk show kind of person but she was like really nice in person and it was really interesting to see how they filmed a tv show so this was about the Casey Anthony case the judge from the Casey Anthony case was there a juror well like an alternate juror was there and someone who shared like a prison cell with Casey Anthony was there like while she was in holding not like a prison cell but they were in prison together and they like talked through letters and stuff so it was pretty interesting it was more interesting to kind of just like seeing how they film a tv show but I didn't get home until 12 o'clock so my morning class this morning was not canceled I thought for sure we we're gonna have a snow day my predictions were wrong but I woke up at six o'clock and I was so freaking tired and I Lisa my friend texted me she was like I cannot go to class and I was like thank god you said that because I cannot go either I'm so tired and I didn't want to be the only one not going but she didn't go either so thank god we were both so tired Liana went I don't know how the hell she did that but she went and then at like 10 o'clock they canceled our afternoon class so 
I don't have to go to contracts today, thank God, because I'm doing my con law homework for tomorrow and it's taking me so long because I'm so tired. But that is all. I just wanted to finish this vlog so it didn't just end randomly. My mom is vacuuming and it's really loud, so I'm going to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was definitely a different day in my life, not my usual monotony, so that's why I decided to vlog. Hopefully you enjoyed. Please give it a thumbs up if you did. Giving a thumbs up or even a thumbs down on a video really helps me out. The way YouTube works is like, even if people are watching your video, if they aren't engaging by liking it or disliking it or leaving a comment, it's not kind of, it's not boosted in YouTube's algorithm. So that means less people will see it. So I, the more engagement you get, the more likely your video is to be seen by more people. Make sure you subscribe if you aren't and I will see you in my next video. Peace out. I don't know what you've been told, but the sky right here.